Hello YouTube, today I will be showing you how to install Windows Vista on VirtualBox. Okay, the first thing you'll need is VirtualBox, so that's that will be in the link below. So, and you'll also need uTorrent, so that will be in the link of the, below. So once you've downloaded VirtualBox on uTorrent, you go ahead and open VirtualBox. You see them? You then create a new one. Name it. And the just detect it automatically. And if it doesn't, just select what one you want. Click next. Just V2. Just keep on clicking next and create. So after you click um, create, what you want to go ahead and do is download that file that's in the description, the Windows Vista one. Yes, the Windows Vista ISO. After you've, after you've installed that, tip, it might take a long time because it's a really big file. After you've installed that, just save it anywhere, or, but do not run it. Whatever you do, don't run it because then you won't be able to find it. Save it somewhere, or just save it in your downloads. And then after you've done, after you've downloaded that, you go in settings, you select your virtual machine, go in settings, and then it'll appear, so wait until it loads. Go in storage, click on this disk, click on this one as well, go on to select one. So where, wherever you saved it, it should be in there. There should be a folder, called Windows Vista Home Premium for to do it. You double click that and then you double click the um, ISO file. Click OK and then you start it. You say Windows is loading files so Just wait for it now. Wait for the screen to come up. It should come up. Look, the Vista. See that? Click OK. And you see your Windows XP mouse comes up. Windows 7 XP. Just wait until it loads. So come up Windows Vista. Next, click on Install Now. I accept. Next. You don't do upgrade. You go custom. Double click that. Wait until it appears now. Click on this. Click next. Collecting information should be done. Then it's installing Windows files. Then there you have it. 
after this is finished we'll just do some go through some basic settings your name your pictures your theme desktop background and then that will be it done so you'll have windows vista on your virtual box so thank you for watching please comment or subscribe i'm badman jamie and thank you for watching